Hey guys, welcome back to the Suitably Named. My name is Elise and today I have the first of an exciting series that I am bringing to you over the next uh, couple weeks or so. And this series I'm talking about is my travel slash road trip series. I will be going to Florida, Alabama, Florida area um, later this week. By the time you see this, I'll probably be there. But I wanted to make a couple videos and this video that you're about to see is what's in my travel toiletries and makeup bag. I'm going to do them both in this video because this is a longer trip for me so I'm going to take two separate bags and I just wanted to show you how I pack them and how I prioritize and such. And what I want to do is I'm going to show you what I'm bringing and pack it as I go rather than open up the uh, bag that I have and then take everything out. Um, which doesn't even matter because I'm not leaving for a few days anyways, so it's whatever. We'll figure it out. And let's just roll on into it because it might be a little bit of a long video. I hope you guys enjoy. Say bye. So this is the Sonia Kashuk Weekender bag. This is a Target exclusive item, obviously, because that's the only place they sell Target. This is the super bright, poppin' florally color. If you watched my Collective Beauty haul, which I'll have linked below, you will have seen this. This was $30. It was a pretty good deal. So in this pocket right here, I'm actually going to put palettes. So I'm going to pack my Too Faced Chocolate Bar palette. It has every color that you need, just uh, some good neutrals. So I'm going to put, and this will definitely be a contour powder for me, and this obviously a highlight and what I'll set most of my powders with. That, the last thing that's going in here is this uh, quad from MAC. I only have two colors because there are only two colors I wanted. And this right here is nylon, and this is coppering. And this pouch right here, I'm going to be putting eye products. And the first eye product that I'm going to put in here is my Maybelline Master Drama Sculpting. There's no master in there. It's just the Brow Drama Sculpting Brow Gel, which is the CoverGirl Clump Crusher. NYC Liquid Eyeliner. My Tweezer Man Eyelash Curler. This is the Milani Shadow Eyes and Champagne Toast. NYX Br Micro Brow Pencil. I have the Jordana Made to Last Eyeliner, and this is in Espresso Last. And this is the... Rimmel Scandalize Eyeliner in Nude. A Too Faced Mini Shadow Insurance. ColourPop Birthday Girl. ColourPop Taco. The L'Oreal Infallible Eyeshadow in Amber Rush. So the next pouch. This is going to hold my lip products. So the first thing that's going to go in is my Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula Swivel Stick. The ColourPop Lippy Sticks and Fiesta. Two lip liners. This, these are both NYX. I have Peekaboo Neutral and Natural. I'm only bringing two lip glosses. This one is the Revlon Super Lustrous Lip Gloss in Pango Peach. And the NYX Butter Lip Gloss in Creme Brulee. This is the Too Faced La Creme Lipstick in Nude Beach. This is the Maybelline uh, Color Sensational Rebel Bloom Lipstick in... Um, Blushing Bud, the NYX Matte Lipstick and Indie Flick, and the Baby Lips Lip Balm and Melon Mania. So in this uh, compartment here, I'm going to be putting my skincare and my uh, like liquids, so like foundation and concealer and stuff. I'm just going to start out by putting this is my uh, Real Nature Lemon Sheet Mask, uh, just for some moisture and a pick me up in case I want it. These are the uh, the Face Shop Herb Day Cleansing Tissues, which are like the best makeup remover wipes known to man. This is a cleanser I put into a little pot. This is actually, I brought it out to show you, my Tony Moly Clean Dew uh, Smooth and Radiant Foam Cleanser, the blueberry kind, and I just put it into a little pot. This is my uh, Etude House Sun Prize All Proof. This is my um, my sunscreen. This is a little um, sample size of a exfoliator that um, came in an Ipsy bag, and I'm going to pack this in case I need some exfoliation. 
For moisturizer, I'm going to take my Olay Fresh FX, and this is the Bright On Schedule Eye Awakening Cream, and then this is the Do Over uh, Moisturizer. And one last skincare product, this is the Sephora um, Super Regenerating Oil Serum, because I have a feeling my skin will be getting pretty dry. The only foundation I'm bringing is the Maybelline Fit Me Dewy and Smooth. This is my tan shade. This is a little travel size of the L'Oreal uh, Youth Code Pore Vanisher Primer. And this is the NYX HD Concealer Wand. And that is everything packed into this little section of my bag. And this pouch up here, it actually goes all the way down here. Um, I didn't know that. I thought it was only up here. But still, I'm only going to put a few things in there. I'm going to put a nail file, a couple of extra hair ties, some bobby pins, a pair of tweezers, some lash slash brow trimmers, and I'm going to... These are some uh, cotton pads, some Q-tips. I always need Q-tips, so it's good to have. So that's that little pocket back here. For my face products, they will just be going in here. And the first product I have is my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish, and this is in Perfect Topping. Then I have a MAC Hey Sailor Bronzer, and this is in Sun Dipped. This is a MAC Care Blend Pressed Powder, and this is in Medium Plus. Milani Luminoso, duh. This is color pop blush in between the sheets. Elf baked highlighter and blush gems. Look at the pretty. I'm going to bring my posh lashes in number 73, which are just super effing full, as you can see. Because if I'm gonna wear them, I'm gonna go dramatic. So obviously going to bring my uh, lash glue and my little lash applicator. Now for brushes. I am bringing my Real Techniques Face Blender sponge, and I'm going to go ahead and put that right here. For face brushes, I'm going to bring the uh, Real Techniques blush brush, my e.l.f. trifecta, I like to say, which is the small stipple brush, the blush brush, and the small tapered brush. And for eye brushes, I'm first bringing a Sigma E55, the Coastal Sense Big Ass Fluffy Brush, I don't know, Sigma E40, MAC 226, MAC 219. MAC 217. And this is a Naked 3 brush. I just wanted the synthetic side for my ColourPop shadows. By the way, I know how badly these need to be cleaned and I will clean them beforehand. Now we just zip it up and you have all your makeup and skincare handy in this really neat, uh, very, very organized bag. So this is the bag I use for toiletries. This is a Scout um, toiletries bag that was uh, from where I worked last summer. It's broken up here, so they rejected it and gave it to me. So you open, there is a, a zip pocket up here, and then there is just this deep square space in here. And first I'm going to put a pair of nail clippers because oftentimes my nails break and I like to have clippers with me in case that happens. I'm gonna bring another pair of tweezers. This is an extra contact lens case. This is some flaw. Uh, allergy eye drops because my allergies have been horrific. This is my razor. This is like a Chic Hydro Silk whatever that has all the gooey stuff in the blade that I really like. A mini travel size toothpaste. And that's all that's going in the top. Now for the bottom section, I'm going to take, this is just a shower comb. And I'm gonna go ahead and pack my sunscreen in this bag. This is just the Target Up and Up uh, Sport Sunscreen Spray. I'm also bringing my Suave Invisible Glow. I'm not going to squirt this into a travel size because that's just, I can't bother. This is my Sonicare toothbrush system. I'm going to open it up so you can see. It has the, the toothbrush here, like the mechanical part, and then like the bristles on the side. I can't use another toothbrush. This gets my teeth feeling so clean. And as long as I charge it before I leave, it'll stay charged for like two weeks. I'm bringing my uh, Degree deodorant. This is my contact solution, just the Opti Free. This is a hair clip to section off my hair when I curl it. And this is a mini spray. This is an Aveda Control Force. I actually really hate this hairspray, but for the purpose of showing you that I will be bringing a hairspray, I'm gonna put it in here. I'm probably gonna get the Tresemme travel size one before I leave, because I just, I really hate that hairspray. I'm bringing two travel size of the L'Oreal Total Repair 5. My Psst Dry Shampoo. So that's all that's in there for now. I am actually am going to be packing um, the Aussie hair insurance, but I'm going to get a travel mini spray bottle for it. And yes, I will be bringing a body wash. Don't fret. I'm going to use my uh, 
just of uh, purely pampering nutrient moisture and I'm just gonna get like a little squeezy bottle. So this is what the whole thing looks like packed up. As you can see everything fits really nicely and there's room for more. And then that's what's in the top section. So you zip it up and it fits the toiletries perfectly.